Hey, so what's going on everyone? So today, we've got an unboxing. Yeah, smile's kind of all the way down here. I already know what's in here. So now, all of you get to find out. Let's do this. If I can properly open packaging. And this book's a little bit larger than it. Like always, it's a book. Um, Alright. And reveal in three, two, four. Okay, I just screwed that up. Three, two, one. A Peel of Skin, a poetry collection by Thomas Sturgeon, Jr. As you can tell, this book's a little bit larger than uh, the previous book that I featured from him, Red Carnival. So this is Thomas's second book. Uh, for those that are new to this channel, last year I did an unboxing and a review for his book, Red Carnival. That was his first book, which was a collection of horror-themed short stories. This is his second book, which is a book of poetry. Little known fact, that was, poetry was actually my introduction to Thomas's work. Uh, him and I were both featured in the book Organic Ink Volume 1. And I believe that was the first book that was released that him and I were both in. So, there's the front. There's the spine. Here's the back for anyone that wants to pause it. If not, I will be reading it momentarily. A poetry collection of tragedy, love, and forgiveness from Thomas Sturgeon Jr. Each poem is from the hardships of the poet as he delivers from his heart the turmoils and the feeling of being brokenhearted with hope. Thomas Sturgeon Jr. is a 35-year-old author living in Chatsworth, Georgia. He has been featured in 32 anthologies and is also the author of Red Carnival. So, I actually got to find out about this book uh, not long after I featured Red Carnival on this channel. Shortly after that, uh, Thomas informed me that he had already started working on a poetry collection as well as another book that is not my place to mention. Just know that there's another book in the works. And again, like I mentioned earlier, poetry was my introduction to his work. Because even though we were both featured in some other stuff, the first book released was Organic Ink Volume 1 from Dragon Soul Press. I have discussed them in a few different videos. Unfortunately, I can't leave the link in the description below because that book's now out of print. But... Him and I have been featured in multiple anthologies together, and he is the person I did the first review video for, for this channel. After featuring Red Carnival, he had asked me if I would be willing to feature his next book on here, and I'm always willing to feature people. When... Yeah, to any authors out there, if you want your book featured on this channel, I've always got my social media links in the description below. Just Feel free to ask. Just say, hey, can you feature 
my book on your channel? Can you do this? I rarely ever say no. I mainly need a print book, so as long as you've got a print book, that's all I really need. So, he had asked me about featuring his next book. It's like, of course. And with Red Carnival, there will be another video going up very, well, I don't want to say very soon because I am still behind on my reviews, but I will be featuring a review or a peel of skin at some eventual point. So at the end of this video, I will be featuring the link for the unboxing I did for Red Carnival. Yeah, you can see where my camera messed up and I had to shoot the last part of it on my phone outside. Yeah, that was fun. And I will also have a pinned comment in the comment section below for anyone that wants to see the review video I did for Red Carnival. So one of the things that I did mention in previous videos where I featured his books, I can't really leave any social media links in the description because Thomas doesn't have Twitter or Instagram. However, he did tell me to include his personal Facebook page, so to anyone that wants to find out more, send him a friend request. And you can take a look at Peel of Skin, take a look at Red Carnival, at the anthologies he's been featured in over the last few years. There's a lot of stuff that I think a lot of people are going to enjoy when you read it. And Thomas, I know you mentioned you wanted to release this a little bit sooner than you did. So congrats on being able to release your first poetry book. And I'm definitely looking forward to reading this because, again, that was my introduction to your stuff. Being someone who writes poetry myself, I don't really get to feature a lot of poetry on this channel. But that does it for this one. Like I said, I will feature a pinned comment for the review I did for Red Carnival. And at the end of this video will be the link to the unboxing video for Red Carnival. I will feature Thomas's Facebook page link in the description below where you can send him a friend request and learn more about some of the stuff that he's working on. I will also be including my own social media links in the description below. I'm on Facebook, I'm on Twitter, I'm on Instagram. I have a second channel where I read my poetry and my short stories. If you are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. If you enjoy this video, leave a thumbs up. Feel free to post a comment in the comment section down below. I always do my best to respond to comments in a timely manner. And that does it for this video. So thank you all for watching, and I will catch you on the next one.